Hello and welcome to tutorial 18 in the Microsoft Visual Basic 2008 tutorials and in this tutorial we're going to learn about subs or sub procedures. Now a sub procedure is something that can you, it will hold a code and then you can execute it later by just calling the sub procedure. So let's make a new project. We'll call this sub subs. Okay. And again, we're just going to use the message box because I think it's the easiest way to understand. But I'm gonna actually think of something like more creative to use for my next examples. But right now, we're just going to use a message box for this sub. So let's make the text call sub, and then we're going to do some coding. Okay, so up here above the button on the click, we're going to type sub give message, we'll call it, and then we'll have two empty parameters here. And I'll actually tell you what these are in about a few tutorials from now. What is in these, what you usually put in these in subs. But next, I'm going to do about functions, and then I'll do it. But right now you can just leave these this blank and then we'll go on to the code in here. So basically what this is saying is it's going to tell the application that okay here's a sub and the name of the sub is give message and then there's going to be some code here and then it's going to end the sub. So here we're going to have our code. So right now we'll just have something simple as I said message box dot show I am cool for using subs and then we'll have that simply so okay now we've got a sub it just says okay this is a sub the name of that sub is give message and then inside that sub the code to ex execute is a message box that show I am cool for using subs and then it's going to end the sub so how do we call that well we simply type call and then the name of the sub which is give message and then that's it and then we can debug this and hopefully if I click this button there we go I am cool for, for using subs okay that, that's basically what a sub is and in the next tutorial I'll be teaching you about functions and then after that I'm not sure if it'll be right away but I'll be teaching you about what you'll actually put in these brackets here so yeah if you have any questions about subs then just leave a comment if you have any suggestions about how I have do my tutorials leave a comment and if you have any requests for the tutorial leave a comment too so just rate the video down here and subscribe up here thanks for watching